hello one welcome to my youtube channel tech and tips with king in this video quickly i am going to review a brand new windows embedder application which name is winletter application so without any wasting of time let's get into the video from very long time we are using exagir windows emulator and this exagir windows emulator are working very perfectly fine and pretty uh, good in running any PC software in Android so now I'm going to show the another Windows uh, emulator application which we can run any uh, PC software uh, in your Android so this is the another one and this is the new one so the name is win later so the download link in the description you had you need two files the first one is application and second one is the OBB file so first of all let me just uh, paste the OBB file in the OBB folder so as you can see this is the file in the mention in the uh downloading mentioned in the description you can check out and download from there so i'm going to just take it and cut so you have to just click to cut and you have to get into your android folder so this is my android folder and this is the obb folder now here you have to create new folder uh i will provide uh, this name folder name in description so uh this is the folder you have to create in the obb for obb folder dot com win loader so this is the folder you have to create and in this software you have to paste that obb file so the applica the obb file is about uh, 427 mb so it will take some time uh, according to a smartphone uh, so now i have done with the obb file now i'm just get into the dom dot folder and i'm going to install this win letter application so in this video i'm just going to review about this application how pretty much it works so as you can see the win loader application has been successfully installed so let me just show you quickly again there are two files uh, downloading in the description you have to download the first one is application and second one is the obb folder so after downloading obb folder you have to paste it into your android and obb folder so this is the uh, folder you have to create and in this folder you have to paste this file obb file which is about 427 mb the downloading the description and the name is main.2.com.winloader.obb so this is the uh, obb file you have to paste in the android folder now after that you have to download install the windows win later app application the download in the description and for the demo i have uh, uh, downloaded a pc software this is the notepad software for the demo purpose so in this video i'm go just going to give a quick review of this application and how it's work in further videos i'm going to show with another new application we are already having exagir windows emulator as you can see this is the exagir windows emulator application and it's perfectly working with uh, all the pc softwares and there are some software which will not work in the exagir so it will going to work in win later so there are a lot of upcoming videos on my channel so make sure to subscribe to my youtube channel so now i'm going to open the win later software and it will ask you to allow so it's saying installing obb image so make sure make sure after installing the software or before installing the software you will insert that obb file of a folder in the obb folder in android folder so as you can see it will saying image installing obb image it will take some time so as you can see uh, the software is successfully open so let me just uh, quickly give the uh, overview of this application so it's have same interface like uh, exagir windows emulator application so we can say this is the win later win later windows emulator application we can say so basically emulator are the some softwares where we can run another operating softwares so we are using android sort uh, software in android phone but we can uh, run any pc software using this win, win later software so let me just click on the plus button to create the new container uh, the people who are already using exagir windows emulator they will get to know how to create a container they will they, this application are some familiar to exagir windows emulator application now as you can see we are quickly we are going to create a new container so as you can see this is the uh, you can rename any uh, name according to you so i'm going to just give this name my channel name tech and tips with 
so this is my channel name make sure to subscribe and you can select the screen size there are a lot of sizes over here uh, let me just uh, keep on the default because uh, this video is for the only demo purposes so now i'm going to just quick giving quick review of this application so i'm going to just uh, keep it on the default you can select other screen resolutions according to uh software mostly in software uh, that does not require to change the screen resolution but in some games but in some games you can you have to change the screen res resolution so now you can select the uh, graphic drivers so so these are the some extra features which we can get in win later which is not available in the xagir windows and application so this is the some benefits of this application so we can select graphic drivers so let me just keep on the default you can select uh, other according to your application or so this is the dx wrapper which we can select uh, original wine dt2 uh, basically every uh, application which is emulator application which are capable to run many pc software are based on wine only so you can select on show fps so if you are playing any games heavy games or uh, you can click on this show fps so you can make uh, you can see the fps of game so you can select the cpus and now you, you scroll down you can select uh, a command stream multi-thread uh, enable gpu name you can select the gpu and as you can see there are a lot of gpus over here uh, geforce 2 geforce 3 geforce 256 gtx intel hd so let me just keep on default and uh, move on to another feature uh, it's have uh, off screen rendering mode so back buffer fpo six standard mode so there are and the the very good uh, thing which i like about this application is you can select the ram uh, the memory video memory size you can see it's will default on the 2gb but you can it's uh, showing 2048 mb something but you can select it into the 4096 which means you can select the ram in this and mouse over app override so there are a lot of lot of uh, uh, options over available here dx comp so this is the an environment uh, as you can see and the main uh, the main important feature of this application is you can select the path target path of the driver uh, in uh, exeger windows emulator there is no option to select it will automatically always open default download for open the download folder as your d drive to so you can access any uh, internal files so you can change the drive path as you can see you can change you can change the download folder uh, you can select any dsmi folder or any you can create a individual uh, folder to you can access uh, uh, any files in that folder only so this is the very good feature i found in this uh, application so there are a lot of upcoming videos on my channel uh, which i'm going to show with uh, multi different uh, softwares and games and in that uh, and that videos i'm going to explain everything in detail with how you can use any single feature so this is only a review video of this application so here advanced you can select box present compatibility so this is the all the features you can use so uh, let me just quickly select on the right button and it will say creating container and this application is very smooth to use so as you can see the container is created now I'm just click to three dots and click to run after clicking run, it will going to it will saying starting up so it means the application is starting up the environment the desktop mode of this application at first it will take going to take some time so we have to wait over here So as you can see the application has been successfully started over here and you can see the interface it will seem look like the exager windows emulator application but but there is a difference you can see there is a mouse cursor here uh, with in the exager emulator application you have to select uh, that anything with uh, touch but this in this application there is a mouse cursor it's very easy to use if you not understanding you can just uh, swipe from left to right you can get all the uh, options, menu options of this uh, uh, WinLater application. 
this application uh, this option is not available in the executor but this uh, i like and you can select the keyboard from here and you can type and the, you don't did not get any difficulty while using keyboard like this you can see you can still use mouse and you can change the uh, skin direction of the and uh, android phone while typing input controls you can just uh, input the controls so you can play game games over here so if you running any game you are play if you playing any game in this application you can use these controls as you can see so in the upcoming video i will go i will try to show this with any game so toggle full screen so you can do this full screen and now if you the you can easily use this mouse cursor in this application as you can see this very really smooth to use and very easy to use at first you will get some difficulty but after you can understand how to use it so it's very easy to use if you want to uh, select just click on double tap it will going to open so like this so we have selected j as a uh, our uh, main drive and it will it is the uh, main drive which we are can access our android internal storage in this drive so as you can see i have installed uh, application this application will later application my android and it will showing up here this is my uh, android internal folder it's open up as a j drive you can change the drive or you can change the uh, location uh, your internal path you can change it so it's very easy to use with double clicking on it you can uh, get the more options and and you can see it's very easy easy to use so now let me just click on the start button and i'm going to show you more features so as you can see it's have uh, programs it's have some in the already uh, mind game it's already have a game internet explorer it's have internet explorer it's perfectly working but not uh, the latest version but in upcoming video i try to show how you can install the latest version of chrome firefox there are a lot of browsers or desktop browser available i'm going to show so it's notepad wordpad system tools command prop computer task manager so there are a lot of lot of options over here so let me just quickly install any software to show you so you can understand the understanding so i have downloaded the notepad software so i'm going quickly i'm going to install to show you how it's work so i'm just click on the open so i've downloaded the so pc software notepad uh, i think I have opened, so i have downloaded the notepad application of pc software so this is this is the windows version of the notepad i'm going to install so let me just click to ok i'm installing this software that, to just show you the demo how it's working so as you can see this is the notepad plus plus 8 version so let me, let me just click to next i agree next next click to install as you can see that this is the pc software and this is the official version of the notepad plus plus i'm installing uh, in my android phone with the win later uh, application which are very capable to install any pc software in android phone and every software per perfectly work uh, i've tested and in upcoming videos i try to show every single software if you need if you have any requirement of software which we want to run in android phone let me know in the comments i try to make a video on it with the detailed tutorial and the downloading of the software software has been installed so let me just quickly uh, click to finish and i have make checked on the run so after installing it i'm going to run it to show you so i have clicked on the finish the cursor is smooth as you can see it will working very smooth so as you can see it will uh, we are getting full screen of the desktop so you can get the uh, full experience of windows software in your android phone
so as you can see the notepad plus plus software has been installed in my android phone so this is the official version of the notepad uh, plus plus software which is the windows uh, version as you can see now here you can type and save anything so let me just quickly give the uh, overview of this application and i'm going to show you how you can save any uh, file into your android internal storage mostly people get trouble to use pc software in their android phone so this application is perfectly working with the saving the files in your android phone so when you install any pc software you can edit or you can create new file and you can also save in your android internal storage and after that you can access that file in other pc so let me just quickly show you so i'm going to enable the keyboard so now i'm going to type So this is the words I have typed in the PC software. So let me just quickly save it into my Android internal storage. So we'll get better idea what I am trying to say. After uh, so it will going to ask you where to save. So let me just quickly open my computer and we have selected uh, j j drive drive j as a uh, our android internal storage folder so if you want to access any internal android internal storage file you can access from j j drive or if you want to save any file to android you can save into j drive so you can accept ac access in your android later let me just quickly click to save so it has been successfully saved into my android so let me just check whether it's safe or not so i'm going to open file manager so as you can see it has been saved before there is no file over here you can rewind the video and check there is no file over here and it just now created and it's name with the new text.vn what we have written let me just quickly show you i have written hello everyone how are you in this text software so i can access over here now i can transfer this file to any device now i can access this device uh, file in any device so as you can see the saving process is perfectly working so as you can see this is the win letter software perfectly working in android phone and it's capable to save any file and the internet's perfectly working and many things are there and many uh, softwares are there to show you so make sure to subscribe to my channel for further videos so that's it for this video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel like this video share this video if you have a question or problem let me know in the comments thank you